Well, hello and welcome back to We Review You. I'm Sean and some friends of ours over at the company called Top Test, T-O-P-T-E-S, reached out to us and asked if we could partner up on a video collaboration together and talk about one of their really awesome products. It's the CT580 Carbon Monoxide Tester. Have you guys ever seen one of those? In today's video, we'll go over that. I'll kind of give you a little bit of information about them. And I had an idea what I'd test. If I get a chance to do so, I think I'll fire up my generator and make sure I've tested it out. And remember, when you're firing up a generator in an enclosed area or using something that's inside a closed area, you want to make sure you know for sure that you have breathable air. Go to a cave or something like that, you never know. And this thing right here is just exactly what I can use to show that. It has data storage capability, has a really good LCD display, power on and off self-test feature, and it does actually have all the different from zero to 1,000 part per million detection, uh, three types of alarms, and a high and low alarm threshold. If you know exactly what I'm talking about, if you ever go in caving or if you've done anything like that, and carbon monoxide is a concern to you, this is what you're going to need. So today on the video, we'll be reviewing that. Top test carbon monoxide CT580 detector today. We review you. Inside the box, you'll find the actual little case that it comes in. Really nice case, the instruction manual, and a USB charger. And right on the inside of it, wow, really rugged. I can already tell just by the feel of it. Really cool, very rugged, as you can already tell right off the bat. Um, very easy to use. We're just going to press this power button according to the instructions and hold it. If you look, it says press the power button and hold. And then it says welcome. It has the little prompt display, and again, I think at that point you can let off as soon as you see that screen. And it just went through its different tests to make sure that this thing is at 100% accuracy so that you are not left caught off guard when detection of carbon monoxide is very important. So it's running its little sensor warm up. It's telling you that everything is ready. It shows the low and high side and it beeped one time uh, flash to let you know. If you guys didn't hear that through the uh, microphones, it actually beeps and it does have a uh, vibration and very strong one too. So if you'll notice, you'll see the green light flashing to let you know it's ready to sense. And that's pretty much to it. I did notice that at the top of it, and I will go and clarify this, and screw the top. There's a little canister that's screwed in there. It tells you exactly what it is. I'm gonna look and double check. That looks like something you'd be able to reorder from the company if you had to, but anyway, um, we're gonna go out and test this. Like I said, what I think I will do is I'll fire up my generator and I'll actually see, or try to run some kind of scenario where we can see it. My son has a motorcycle that he's out riding when he comes back, if it's in time. I may just see how that is in the garage. You can kind of smell that exhaust. Let's see just how sensitive this unit is. Let's find out, coming right up. It also does have a flashlight feature. If you look on the top of it, you just press the flashlight button. And then to change the different features, you can just literally shift right or left. And then if you press the function button, it actually allows you to go through the event records, alarm settings, calibration, system settings, advanced menu, and information about the device. And simply just press function if you'd like to go into one of those settings. If you'd like to return, you can simply hit the uh, back button, which will take you back, or the power button, I should say, down at the bottom, which takes you back just by tapping it. And right on cue, my son came home with this cool little motorcycle here. And if you guys see the reading, this is in the garage. You notice it's going up to a seven or eight, whereas before it was a zero. As I walk closer to his bike, you can see for sure the garage is filling up with carbon monoxide. See? Now if I go back here to the back, 30. Look at that. Look, oh, now see, we're in a warning. Look at that. Danger. So we definitely would want to get out of here because that means there is way too much. The unit is vibrating in my hands and I'm getting a warning. Let's walk away in a louder audible tone. Let's walk outside and get away from that. Oh, see, it's telling you. But yeah, see, I like doing a live demonstration. So now we're out in fresh air. We've actually got fresh air coming back in. The alarm is changing and it's back to a green level. We want to get that back down to a zero. Incidentally, we still are here in the Great Smoky Mountains. <laughs> I just want to tell you all we're doing a lot of product testing. So thanks to our friends over at Top Test. 
gave us the opportunity to test this product. I wanted to do one where I could actually show you guys something, and you know what? That whacked out perfect here for us, so we can show you guys. And again, you can still see even out here, uh, maybe it's on our clothing, or maybe it's coming out of the garage. We still have got a lot of emission coming out. I'll show you one more time as we walk closer, as we go into the garage. See how it's automatically starting to build up and it's warning us immediately. Oh, listen to those warnings. Listen to those warnings. So you definitely are filling up that garage. I'm going to turn the bike off here. And I'm going to turn the fan on. And she's automatically starting to go back down. And we're back into the green all right so as you can see it right here she definitely works and you will know it and see the vibration and feel it i should say in your hand see the screen come to life so garage still has a little bit in there but it is cleaning out so good job people at top test i would definitely give you a two thumbs up all right you guys saw it here this is sean with we review you reviewing this product for you is what we love to do. If you've got a product out there that you'd like us to display for you and do an independent test, we'd love to do it. Information is in our About Us. Send us an email and let us know how we can test your product. Like our friends over at Top Test. CT580. Get yours today. Link's in the description. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again real soon right here on We Review You. Take care, everybody. To turn it off, just simply press and hold the power button down, and it does go off, as you can see. I'll place it back in its case and this is a very rugged case I'd highly recommend keeping it stored inside of that so I want to thank you again for watching this video today and I want to thank our friends at top test t-o-p-t-e-s for reaching out to us and asking if we could do a collaboration on one of their awesome products today I'm glad I got one of these I know if I ever did need to use it in a pinch like I've illustrated for you today making sure that not too much exhaust carbon monoxide uh, maybe you got a fire going maybe it's winter time you got a fire in the fireplace and the alarm goes off, was it a carbon monoxide scare or was it a smoke scare? But with this, you'd be able to know. Now, maybe some of you are not going to be that picky. That's fine. I think applications would be more like I told you. Maybe you're going caving. Uh, maybe a concern if you're in a garage around places that a lot of carbon monoxide could build up. This is a way to find out. Again, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Thanks to our sponsors at Top Test. And we'll see you guys again right here on We Review You. See y'all. Tired of searching for library music? Find the perfect track in seconds. AI search, intuitive tags, search exclusions, fresh, curated, original by award-winning artists, trusted by major brands and creators. No copyright strikes, just great music. Melody. Yeah, so shout out to our friends over at Top Test. Thank you for reaching out to us. And just a reminder, if you've got a product that you'd like us to review, just reach out to us at wereviewyou2 at gmail.com. That's wereviewyou2 at gmail.com. Send us a message. Let us know what it is. We'll get back to you as fast as possible. Leave a comment. Let us know what you think. Did that help you out? Maybe you're going to find one. Hope it helped you. We enjoy these videos. Hope you do too. And we'll see you all again soon right here on We Review You. Thanks for watching.